Hello everyone, you all are welcome to this channel. Today we will discuss this question. There are three circles, identical circles with centers A, B and C are drawn as given in the diagram. Each circle is passing through the center of other two circles. This circle is passing through C and A. This circle is passing through B and C and similarly this is passing through A and C. Radius of each circle is 6 cm and we have to find the area of the shaded portion. So to get the area of the shaded portion, if we join these intersection points like this from here to here, from here to here, this point, this point and this point will be collinear and the triangle so joined will be an equilateral triangle. Let these point be P, Q, R these points of intersection of uh, circles and PR, PQ and QR are joined which passing through points A, B and C. This PA and R will be collinear because PA is radius, AR is radius and PR is diameter because passing through the center. Two radius will be diameter which would pass, the, uh, pass through center. So that is why PR PQ and QR all are diameters of the identical circles. To get the required shaded area, if we find this semicircles area and if we subtract these two white segments, then we will get this part and if we multiply with these three identical shaded part, we will get the required area. So let us do for this semicircle and these two segments. We are given that radius of each circle be 6 cm. So this is 6. This is 6 and this is 6. All are 6. This triangle is an equilateral triangle. This is also an equilateral triangle with 12 cm as the side of the triangle. This is 60 degree. If we find this sector's area and subtract this triangle's area, we will get this segment. And these two segments are equal. So if we find one segment's area and double it, we will get some of these two. These two segments are identically equal. So if we find this area and subtract like this then we will get this shaded part and then if we multiply by 3 we will get the whole shaded area required so to get this uh, segment area let us suppose this is y so this will also be y so the shaded part is half pi r square pi r square r is 6 here minus 2y which is equal to 36 pi by 2 which is 18 pi minus 2 and this is what sectors area minus triangles area sector is what sectors area is pi r square theta over 360 so pi 6 square theta is 60 pi r square theta over 360 minus area of this triangle this triangle is equal to triangle minus root 3 by 4 and side square which is 6 square so that we found 18 pi minus these two we will get cut 60 times 6 and this 6 and this will get cut so it is 6 pi into 2 12 pi minus 36 by 4 is 9 9 minus 9 root 3 minus 2 so plus 18 root 3 so that is coming 18 pi minus 12 pi is 6 pi plus 18 root 3 
this shaded area is this if this is x so this will also be x and this is x all the three shaded part will be the required shaded area is equal to 3x and this shaded area x is equal to this thing this so therefore 3 into 6 pi plus 18 root 3 that we found 18 pi plus 54 root 3 centimeter square and if we further simplify we will get 18 into 3.14 plus 54 into 1.732 centimeter square and after simplification it will be 150 point zero five centimeter square approx and this is the answer.